two ways. Um, most well, the first way is that it's um, in between lands because I've just come back from my first ever solo trip to France, and um, on the Eurostar as I was going under the ocean between France and England, um, I was thinking about how I was in between lands, and it's also an ad a bit of an adaptation of a piece I did recently at Volta where I improvised it and it was it, what it was meant to be about um, introversion and extroversion and confidence and shyness but as I was doing it on the spot that was like quite difficult but I've sort of um, listened to it back then and tried to make it make more sense so the poem is called L'Eur de Magie Forget about golden hour we have magic sur la mer entre la France et l'Angleterre I'm not hypermanic once the moment, yet I feel the best, better than when I was. Now I'm in between manic and depressive, euphemic. En France, I felt slightly anxious some mornings, but for the most part, all has been grand, and it didn't take me long after years of longing to make the specific travelling plan. All I've got to do now is get this last train, de mon retour to Norwich, no particular seat and eat a farmer's pill to get from a Parisian all vegan boulangerie. There's no way that having done this trip I can have ASD. There I said, pardon smoothly, très souvent, with pride. Ici I might whisper apologies, but I'm not sorry. I won't présenter mes excuses pour qui je suis, a clumsy person. But I do. I say things, things just for the sake of it, dans l'intérêt de rien, non plutôt pour celui de la musique de la langue. Langston Hughes, Harlem Renaissance, I know nothing of Hughes or history, but a broken wing, a broken winged bird that cannot fly in a barren field, but je viens de voir une debouche de tableau de la Renaissance in the Calvert Museum, Avignon. My first trip there, I was asked where I was from. I've known for years the French of the country, but couldn't understand it straight away from the receptionist. The next time I came, I did because of that. If the only French they hear I have happens to be in basic phrase books, et parfois, I can't even understand that, they might not realise what they don't really need to know. Ça va would have sufficed in the taxi, but I had to unreserve myself to prove myself, especially because when I was asked to be taken to the station, I accidentally literally asked to be taken to the station I literally needed to be taken to. Am I an introvert? Well, I can't be. If I talk less, I don't have enough time to be me. There were way too many people on this train, but it has cleared now. Fetch, I got to my own brand paprika Pringles, corn nuts and France made cakes. Is not talking much introversion or is it shyness? Sometimes it is simply scrammy. Shyness can stop you from doing all the things in life you'd like to, like asserting that people move down to that carriage and out to the vacant seats. Or was it that I didn't want to be too far from my valise? Hypermania. I thought it was my superpower. No, my superpower was is that I travelled without it. Would you rather go to the cocktail party or read it? Would you rather read the cocktail party or watch it? <laughs> Would you rather listen to the cocktail party or speak it? What about a mixture? You could listen to T.S. Eliot's On the Way to Chums. Raise your hand if you'd rather read The Cocktail Party than The Babysitter. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's the same response I got when I actually. <laughs> Raise your hand if you'd rather read The Babysitter than Badgerland. Okay, yeah, nice, catch me, yeah. <laughs> uh, Put your hand up if you've got books overdue. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely.
Put your hand up if you know the cocktail party I mean. <laughs> Are all of us actually in between? Now who is left around the edges? Here we go.